guys, welcome. I'm Ann Hartley. We're in my kitchen at home today. I'm with my mother, Gay Seta, otherwise known as Gigi. Many of you know her. And we are going to cook a recipe today from the Vintage Recipe Cookbook that was first published in 1977 that we republished at the Seagrove Village Market. So we are doing today Junie's Marinated Shrimp, which is on page five if you have the cookbook. The recipe calls for five pounds of shrimp, so unless you're having a really big party, that's a lot of shrimp, you're gonna wanna cut that recipe in half, which is what we did. I cooked my shrimp, as the recipe says, beforehand, and I used the Zatarain's Extra Spicy Crab and Shrimp Bowl. I like that, because it's a little bit zingier. So, here's what we do. We're gonna do the oil. Onions that have been ringed out like this. Salt and pepper the red wine vinegar, and this also works nicely with white vinegar too. Capers, and I like the bigger capers. Lemons that have been sliced. Celery seed. We like to put bay leaves in ours. Add my Tabasco at the end. This is gonna give it a little more color, a little more zip too. It should sit at least 24 hours in a covered container. I think you're gonna love it. One thing that I like to do too is to just cut up some chives to give it a little extra green and maybe sprinkle that on just before you get ready to serve it. It's a great hors d'oeuvre appetizer thing to serve for a party and just get a really great cracker, fork or a spoon, slotted spoon. Dig in there. Put onion rings, they're the best. Mmm, delicious, before it even marinates. Oh yeah, y'all are gonna love it. 